Hello Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Welcome and welcome cross watchers. I'm going to be taking a look at what is going on for you guys in your situation with you and the person that is on your mind. Whenever you come across this reading will be the right time for you to see it. And as always, take what resonates and leave out the rest. If by the end of this reading you're still needing some more messages or confirmation, you can always take a look at your other placements. That's always an option for you. And if you are interested in personal readings, that information I leave in the description box below for you guys as always. Okay, let's see here. here. What is happening for you? What is going on for you, Sagittarius? Oh, all right. So, Sag, three of swords in your past. Someone has hurt you hard and you have been disappointed. Um, this could have even been a third party situation here. And it, it really broke your heart. You've let, you've let go of this. You've let go of a burden. Something that was weighing heavily on your shoulders. You had to let go because it was causing you pain. It was suffocating. And we have paradise, happiness, expansion, joy, playfulness, oneness, enjoying each other. It's like all of those things went out the window. You usually you don't care. Or you or not to say you don't care, but you're not that connected to your emotions. You're not that emotional. But this situation really hurt you. Things are have been in limbo. There's been doubts, no action taken, waiting, painfully waiting, waiting in heartbreak. Either you or them. But you let go. You drop this burden. So right now, you're self-indulging. You have self-indulgence. Focus on self, your self-worth, time to heal, shadow work, and self-appreciation. So now it's time to heal. Now you're doing the work. Your self-worth. You had to let go, and that was an act of love for yourself. That was you realizing your self-worth. And your self-appreciation. So I see you hanging out with friends. Or I see something, some sort of celebration coming up. A reunion coming up here. Three of Cups. Um, I see you celebrating... There's some party that you may be going to, um, but I see you still have love for this person. You still love them, but you're not really communicating with them. You're taking a leap of faith towards a new beginning. You're trusting your, your instincts here. And... You don't know what's what's going to happen. You don't know what's to come. But you're doing it anyways. And you're you're regaining your happiness. Your happiness is the main focus here. Celebrating yourself. Celebrate yourself. So it's clear to me that Two of Cups reversed. The There has been a disconnect 
with this person. Then maybe you felt like it was the one at one point. And now you're you're saying I'm going to find the one who actually who won't put me in this situation. So let's take a look at the person on your mind, Sagittarius. If you don't have anyone on your mind, this is just someone in your energy field. Okay, Five of Cups. So it's tough. They're having a tough time right now. And they're very emotional. They are, there's a lot of tears that they're shedding right now. They definitely feel your loss. Okay. They're realizing that they lost an empress. Regrets. They're having big, big regrets. Big time. In their energy, we have the sword and the rose. Clarity, truth, revelation, solidarity, force, honor, protection, and power. So these changes, they're not handling it well. They're trying to get your attention. It's saying, I have all of this attention from everybody else except for the one that I actually want. They feel betrayed. Um, this is painful for them as well. They want to communicate. Princes of Cups. So, they want to give you their love cup. There's communication coming from this person. Maybe even an apology. Let's take a look at the near future for you, Sagittarius. Ooh. I'm seeing that in the near future, nothing really is changing. I see stagnation, two of swords. Something is stagnant at a crossroads about accepting an offer that is being given um i won't that's something i see that it's you're not rejecting this offer but you're not saying yes to it either you're at a crossroads about it i see you're upset still you're still upset at this person and we have a clock so need time takes time and time and cycles time to heal and progress so it's time to heal you're seeing that there's this needs more time. This situation needs more time. You're at a crossroads with this person about a commitment, a relationship. I'm, I see that somebody, I see that you may be feeling like you missed out on opportunity with this person by not making a decision. I don't see any action being taken towards a commitment though. But in your outcome, we have love. Unconditional love, self-love, oneness, passion, affection, and attraction. So let's take a look at that. Let's take a look at that outcome. For you. Could be dealing with a Pisces, a Cancer, or Scorpio. Ooh. Temptation? I'm seeing that there's a temptation here. To reconcile. In your outcome, I see love. I see someone, I see giving and receiving. So, 
this is this is someone you make them weak in the knees you make this person weak in the knees and I am seeing you're you're very tempted to to reconcile here this is someone from the past is coming back around with love but I'm seeing fears as well fears about a, a reconciliation here I am seeing giving though someone's ready to give now but at the same time massage I see you have I'm seeing that you're giving your time or energy to two people okay so let's get some details and some specifics for you guys Yep, this is past love. This is someone from the past. We have an ice king. Someone could be very tall or bulky, could have facial hair. This is... I see that you and this person could both be pretty mature. Like, by mature I mean older. Um, a mature woman I'm seeing. So this person is coming towards you with communication. They have a love offer that they want to give you. I see them wanting to invest in you. Um, and I see some sort of spiritual growth happening in the next few weeks. Healing, Reiki, meditation. You or this person could be into that or very spiritual. So let's get a few more cards. Is there anything else that we should know for Sagittarius? else so we should know for Sagittarius I see this person trying to get closer to you you're very close to achieving your goal so I'm seeing that also money you're very close to achieving um, financial wealth in your outcome six of discs enough to give Personal issue reaches a, a resolution. So there is a resolution. I see that some. I see an apology. Could I'm seeing could be coming from a Cancer or Pisces. A lot of water. So things have been very emotional here. But this person has been meditating and contemplating on things, thinking about you. This person has love for you, and they want to give you their love offer. We have love in your outcome. So I see you guys actually coming to that together and giving to each other. So with that being said, this is what I'm getting. If it resonated, let me know in the comment section down below. And if you found some guidance or clarity, also let me know. If you made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching. Bye.